Aloha everybody and welcome to Beach Walks with Rocks at beachwalks.tv. Today is show number 51. The sun is out and I'm going swimming. So before we go swimming, I'm going to throw Lexi the ball and I'm going to just leave the camera set up so you can enjoy this beautiful view and uh, I'll be talking to you and Lexi will be getting a ball and then we're going to go swimming. So, you know, it's something a little different but it's uh, me, myself and I and Lexi here today so we'll see how it goes, alright? So I wanted to talk today about relationships. I have a very unusual relationship with uh, my secret cameraman who, uh, let's call him SCM for today. And right now, uh, one of the reasons he's not here and I'm shooting by myself is that he's in Europe on a vacation. He's a really hard working guy, grew up on a farm in Iowa, started working when he was a very young man and, you know, worked seven days a week. So I'm absolutely delighted that he's learning how to take a little bit of time off for himself. What makes it, I think, interesting, over here, Lex, is that he is met, um, going to see and staying with his former wife. And uh, my friends, you know, when I first told my friends, you know, they were kind of like, uh, he's what? He's going to Europe for a week with his ex-wife? Actually, she's been living and working over in Ireland for the last three years and she's on her way back to the United States this summer and we were thinking that it would be a great opportunity for him to be able to travel to Europe because he's never been and have a friend, operative word, to have a friend that he could stay with that could sort of show him the ropes. He hasn't done much traveling. In fact, he just got his first passport. So um, it's all, all very, very cool stuff. I have an ulterior motive. I'd love to go traveling in Southeast Asia. And that's a little bit more um, challenging travel than, than going to English speaking countries. So uh, I consider it laying the foundation for something that I want to do. But anyway, it was very cute. My, <clears throat> my father said, I was on a conference uh, speakerphone with my parents and I had already told my dad and he was a little bit skeptical about this whole notion. And my sister said, so what is he going for? Is he going for business? And my dad chimed in right away and said, um, he's going for monkey business. <laughs> And that's kind of the default that most people think. They think, oh, well, they used to be married. They were lovers. Undoubtedly, there are, there's an ulterior motive here, but I don't think there is. <clears throat> and I actually think it's very, very sweet that the two of them can still be close, good friends with each other, even though they've decided not to be married. And that's the, way, that's the kind of world that I want to live in, where um, people can spend time together, very, very intimate time together, and then realize that, that life happens and things change, and then they're ready to you know, go separate ways, but not necessarily cut everything off, not have to make one person bad, one person good. Uh, I, I just think it's very, very cool. This whole notion of sexuality being this threatening component in a relationship, I don't buy into. I really, I have complete trust in my uh, SEM, and I know that the value of the relationship that we have far exceeds, you know, any kind of... Um, week of sex, even, and I don't think that's what's happening. Whoop! Look out! Anyway, <laughs> you can see it's really hard for me on some of these shows. I have the wind, which is very distracting. I have Lexi, I have you, I have me, 
And then I try not to aim the ball at the poor people on the beach. <laughs> but that's got to be it for the show. So thanks for joining me today. This is David Brazell. He's 86 years old, swims every day. Pardon? I have the body of a 16-year-old kid. Oh, well, that's good. That's because I swim every day like you do. <laughs> Say hi to the people. You mean you're, you're recording all this? Yes. You're a character. I know. I'll go turn it off. <laughs> good to see you. Have a wonderful day. Thank you. You too. Thanks for joining me. You can Skype at Roxanne Darling, or you can leave a voice comment at 949-544-1456. Aloha and I love you.